As you all know, I came, I came from Egypt like 10 years ago, uh, never expecting that one day I would be addressing the Muslim community here in Hong Kong or that I will try my best to deliver the message of Islam to non-Muslims. I came with a different intention altogether, but this is how Allah planned it, that it happens that as time goes by, myself, my wife have witnessed uh, I don't know how many hundreds have entered to Islam, whether here uh, I witness them here in Hong Kong or when I travel to the Philippines. Actually, my sisters, you should be very, very proud because you are belongs to the group of the companions of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon You are belongs to that group. Myself, Brother Salim, Brother Ali Diallo, Brother Nuho, Brother Hatim, and all those who were born in an Islamic country or born as Muslims, from Muslim parents. They had no choice but to become Muslims. We didn't have any choice. We were just made to be Muslims through our family. They taught us this is the way how it should be. But you have gone through some struggle. You were born in a Christian country. You were raised as Christians. You used to attend church masses. Some of you were devoted Christians who used to be even part of the Christian uh, programs. Yes, but yet, subhanAllah, you have gone through that struggle, you have studied Islam, you start reasoning together, and the decision was very hard to change an entire life of being a Christian into Islam. The decision must be very, very tough. And this is what exactly happened to the companions of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu peace be upon him, and one of them is Omar ibn Khattab, who was about to kill the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and just on that same day where he intended to kill the Prophet, he declared that there is only one God and that Muhammad is the messenger People of God. People normally want to remain and stick to what their parents and the society surrounding them used to do. They don't want to change that way. Even though some of them realize this is not the right path. Alhamdulillah, you have accepted to take that step, changing from what you believe was not correct to what is now correct. This truth you are holding, the shahada you have taken, is the best thing you have ever done for yourself. It's not for me or for Brother Wail or for serving Islam team. It's not for any other human being. It's not for your parents. It's not for the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. It's for your own self. Allah mentioned in the Quran that, O Muhammad, this is the truth. Call the people onto it. Let them believe or let them reject it. It's up to you. The decision is yours. I was born Christian and I was a Catholic before. I came to serve Islam to have a shahada here. I listen and learn the message sharing by one of our brother. I find the answer to my question about the concept of one God. Alhamdulillah, I cannot explain the happiness in my heart, in my life. I've never thought that one day I I embrace I convert in Islam. This is the this is the first time I hear about Islam in my life. Um, because I, I I thought that Islam only for the Muslim people, for the Arab people only and born Islam, uh, born Muslim. One day I'm going to Chincha Choy most I get a one book of Quran and I meet one uh, I meet brothers uh, from Egypt, this is from Egypt, and uh, I remember I met uh, Brother Muhammad. Actually, if I hear Muslims, I got the allergy, like they are, t I, I know Muslim only is a terrorist. Uh, as of now, uh, since and then even I go back to Philippines, I, I, I promise never to go back as a Christianity. My friend always tell to me not to go in 
in, in Islam because it's no good. But I feel in my heart that I want to be a Muslim. Even even my friend don't don't want me to be a Muslim. But but my heart always he want to, to to be a Muslim. Even I'm now I'm alone. Always go here. No friend because all my friend is Christian. But I don't care if I'm alone. Even my parents did not know because they don't like Muslim. It's very hard for me because my family is my witness. This is my very very first time in Islam. Before this morning, my friend talked to me. We go to Islam Center and I asked her why. Why Islam? And who is that Allah? And I talk to her, Allah ka? Sabi ko, I talk to her, Allah ka? And no. And, and now, uh, Allah, I know that Allah will forgive me. When one time they are distributing books in Central, and then and then when I found out that she is, that she is a Filipina also, I asked her, why well, I, I, I also want to become a Muslim. My friends, they haven't accepted it. They hate me, don't go with us, or you have your own way. My difficult when I become a Muslim is my parents because they don't like that I am become a Muslim. I know that there is only one God, that is Allah. Actually, my family, they not accept me. Four years I uh, was active in St. Joseph. I don't go to Central or anywhere else. So now if you ask me to go somewhere, I don't know where to go. Four years, I take a taxi to go to St. Joseph, take a taxi to go home. And I am um, uh, right, right hand of those sisters there to arrange the, the liturgy of the mass, something like that. Allah, give me that sign in a dream that in my dream there are four souls flying up high in heaven and they, they uttering la ilaha illallah so it's uh, opening my heart and then immediately i call my sister i said i want to embrace islam and then my sister said are you sure she said yes uh, have you think your family what your family will tell up will uh, tell about you say I don't care for now on, I want to be a Muslim. So at uh, that time, two weeks, there is a conversion in uh, Masjid Ammar and I am, I am one of those who declare my shahada, alhamdulillah. Ashadu an na ilaha illallah wa ashadu anna muhammadan abduhu wa rasulullah. I bear witness that there is only one God worthy of worship, that is Allah. And I bear witness that Muhammad is the messenger of God. So what I want to the sisters, the newcomers to tell is hold on to the rope of Allah because everybody, you will be tested because he said, not, not because you believe you will not be tested. You will be tested with so many trials, so hold on. You, you have to search knowledge. And um, like Sister Sharifa said, be strong and hold on to the rope of Allah and be steadfast, you know.